I'm Peter Fallon, and I am seeking our party's endorsement for the county board vacancy. I am running because I am the best candidate to continue Arlington's long-standing tradition of good government based on electing qualified candidates with years of broad-based community experience, a strong record of commitment to local public service, and embracing Arlington's core community values. I am the candidate with the extensive record of experience across multiple areas necessary to balance competing priorities, find solutions, and govern the best interests of the people of Arlington. My family and I have made Arlington our home for more than 25 years. Early on, I followed the example of so many others and became deeply involved in the ongoing effort to make Arlington a better place for us all. Arlington has much to be proud of, but we have to be ready both for the challenges and the opportunities ahead. To be successful, Arlington needs leadership with the knowledge and the experience, coupled with the willingness to accept the consequences associated with their decisions. I have served in the Arlington County Planning Commission since 2004 and as the chair of it in 2009. I chaired a zoning committee for three years and I have served as the, county, the commission's liaison to our affordable housing commission for the past two years. I served on the transportation commission for three years. I have served on more than a dozen task forces and special committees during this period. I have the essential first-hand experience across many areas of government to do this job. I have used my voice at the table to make a direct impact on the development of county policy for many years. I have long-standing ties to Arlington. My experience will be evident in tonight's forum. Thank you, and I look forward to your questions this evening. Hello, Arlington Democrats. I'm excited to be here tonight to listen to your questions and to share my vision for Arlington. As your county board member, I would bring my broad understanding of progressive policies and more than 10 years experience working in diverse communities to achieve our important goals. That starts with Arlington's children, <coughs> giving them the resources they need to excel. Our outstanding public schools are fundamental to our success as a community, and that's how I'll value them as a county board member. We must also support our other core services, such as public safety, infrastructure, and maintenance. Since 2004, I've led efforts in Arlington and across Virginia to expand housing choices that residents can afford. I worked directly with tenants to preserve their communities. I advocated for progressive housing benefits and development projects, and I co-authored Arlington's Affordable Housing Ordinance, the strongest law in the state. I've worked to prevent homelessness and for human services programs that have helped thousands of Arlington residents. With fellow environmental leaders, I helped to create Arlington's Fresh Air Initiative, Together, we've increased green building incentives and energy conservation and improved stormwater protection and management. In dozens of plans across Arlington and the region, I have pursued best practices in smart growth development, protecting neighborhoods, and improving our sustainability. In 2008, I gave up my car, so I know the value of reliable walking, biking, and transit traces. We know that our excellent transportation network is critical to Arlington's economy. We must also compete for new 21st century jobs in science, technology, and healthcare. And we must further support our small businesses and pursue tourism and the arts. For more than 10 years, I've brought my own ideas and energy to push Arlington forward. I've urged the board to adopt solutions that uphold our progressive values and put people first. Together with your help, we can begin a new generation of ideas and excellence here at home. I'm really looking forward to your questions. Thank you. Thank you, ACDC, for providing this forum for me and my fellow candidates to speak with you all this evening. As many of you know, after growing up in Northern Virginia, I went on to graduate from West Point and then served in the U.S. Army. During my 15 months in Iraq, I developed and mentored a local district government in Baghdad. I greatly appreciated being amongst the people, walking the streets, talking with people, visiting the schools, going to local businesses, even drinking tea with the local elders. I love this form of service, assisting private citizens in realizing their visions and dreams for their communities and their children. Now, I would like to continue that same form of service here in Arlington. With my experience of bringing communities and people together, along with my system engineering background, I intend to foster an environment of community activism and collaboration. <coughs> As an Arlington County Board member, my focus will be maximizing the effectiveness of our tax dollars, improving the collaboration between Arlington County government and Arlington Public Schools, and promoting thoughtful growth 
so that all Arlington residents can continue to live, work, shop, and raise their families here in this great and wonderful county. As I move forward with my vision of Arlington, I will always seek to maximize citizen involvement in producing effective solutions. I will always keep in mind the motto of Arlington's Independence Center, do nothing for me without me. Thank you for your time, and I look forward to discussing with you my candidacy <coughs> and my vision for our county. Thank you. Good evening. I am Kim Klingler, and I am both proud and privileged to serve on multiple community organizations, boards, and advisory commissions. But truly, I believe that in order to understand the needs of our community, we must meet people where they are. Through my work as a volunteer first responder, through snowmageddon, through hurricanes, through day-to-day -day emergencies, through my volunteerism as a volunteer at the Arlington Free Clinic, I have seen people in Arlington with unmet needs. Through my conversations on hundreds of doors, I have heard your thoughts and your concerns. And let me tell you what I've been hearing. Our community is asking for a comprehensive plan to address our dwindling affordable housing and our increasing density. Our community is asking for short-term as well as long-term solutions to address our school capacity issues. We are asking, also asking for the ability to maintain a diverse and caring community, which means so much to us here in Arlington. I have also heard that our res residents want their new board member to be connected to our community, to prioritize and to spend wisely, and to also be an independent voice. <laughs> my work as a community volunteer, as well as my leadership in the business community, and my overall approach make me uniquely qualified to be this new board member. I thank you so much for your time tonight, and I look forward to your questions. Thank you. All the Democrats here tonight and good, great candidates. The question is, who is best able to manage change so that as we move forward, Arlington grows, it stays the community we love? This is a pivotal time for Arlington. We need leaders who know how to manage change, move us <coughs> forward, but keep what we value most. We face some big challenges affordable housing, transportation, growth, maintaining core services, and all in a time of tight budgets. For the past 15 years, I've been managing change on the school board. And our schools have seen a lot of change. In 1996, there were inequities in our school system. Our capital program was a mess, and I ran for school board to make things better. Since then, we've renovated and rebuilt almost every one of our schools, largely on time and on budget. We closed the achievement gap by about 50%. All four of our high schools are in the top 2% nationwide. People like Arnie Duncan and companies like Boeing moved to Arlington for our good schools. I've worked with 11 different school board members, hired two chief executives, most voted on 15 budgets, uh, the most recent almost a half a billion dollars. Arlington Public Schools employs more people than any other organization in the county except the federal government. We run a large transportation system, a large food service system. I've been chair five times. I know how to do this job. And we face tough issues on the school board. I'm proud of the progress we've made. We've come so far because we have clear goals and priorities and we stick to them. We're transparent. We monitor how we are doing and we report to our public. We keep looking ahead to work strategically, for example, because we pressed forward getting Wakefield, Wakefield designed, we could take advantage of suddenly low construction costs, and that saved about $30 million. This way of working is exactly what we need in the next county board member to make sure that as we grow and change our core services, public safety, education, transportation, infrastructure, and safety net for our most vulnerable remains strong. And Arlington remains the diverse and vibrant community we love. That's our goal, and that's why I'm running. Thank you.